Hey, we got an early Christmas gift today from Toronto. This morning, Mayor Rob Ford um, apologized to members of the Toronto City Council for calling them corrupt. He called them corrupt yesterday. It was kind of a half apology. He said he was super, 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 super sorry. <laughs> it's, it's not just food. He supersizes everything. But he apologized because Council Speaker Francis Nunziata demanded it. It was a contentious exchange between them, but then something magical happened. And rather than tell you about it, I think it best to show you what happened today. Yeah, he's absolutely right, the mayor is. Uh, he's done nothing wrong. He didn't have to apologize today. I think it's good that he did because of the way you just des uh, described it, Jerry. Uh, it was kind of a nudge, nudge, wink, wink thing, but he didn't have to do it. All right, just before we go further on this, apparently they're dancing at City Hall. Look at that. Isn't that great? There's the mayor. Boogie down, Mayor Ford. I smell another apology coming, folks. And the, the one in the red is uh, the speaker, Francis Nunziata. That's fantastic. Is that real? This is happening live. This is happening right now. They are. It's Merry Christmas at Toronto City Hall. <laughs> what the hell is going on? Are they all on crack? That, by the way, that's the woman who forced them to apologize. One minute they were yelling at each other, the next minute they're dancing all around the room. <laughs> Here's the thing, I, I think this Mayor Ford experience has been very educational. For a while, I thought it was just him. I thought it was just Mayor Ford, but what I've realized is Canadians are much, much weirder than any of us had any idea they were. <laughs> and they, they seem so normal, but they're not. They're different. And I think that is important that going forward, we keep this in mind. These people are coconuts, though, and we could be in danger. Do we have any Canadians with us here tonight? All right, we're gonna keep an eye on you.